Superheroes took over Kelowna General Hospital Saturday morning, putting smiles on the faces of patients of all ages. The folks behind the random act of costuming have been coming to the hospital about once a month for more than two years. And sometimes uh, laughter and, and uh, a change of pace can actually bring or help the body to heal and uh, it gives uh, at least a, a hope. The idea came after Scott lost his seven-year-old granddaughter, Savannah, to a rare form of cancer. I just became aware of what other, what other people are dealing with in a, in, a, in a deeper way. And after she passed away, we decided to make it a, a positive spin on it. Uh, we can't bring her back, but we saw what happened in the different wards and how the children had to walk through some really you know, difficult things. So we decided to come here and help out and you know, to bring some smiles and hopefully cheer people up. We can't change what they're doing or what's going on in their lives, but we can hopefully make it better. He's been stuck kind of in and out of appointments for the last, uh, I don't know, month and a half. So it's great to, great to break up the uh, monotony of sitting in the hospital waiting for the next doctor or, or nurse to come by. So yeah, thanks so much. Uh, in and out, in and out, test, test, test. So, so yeah, it's, it's definitely nice to, nice to see some fun faces. Well, it was very surprising. Superman, I didn't know what was going on. I remember they kept coming and kept coming and kept coming. It was quite a deal. Spider-Man is behind you. Oh, that's so <laughs> scary. That is a bit scary. Made my morning. The whole gang will be back at KGH next month. For Castanet News here in Kelowna, I'm Nick Johansson.